this video, we will learn misconceptions related to the concept of equations. So far, we have known that there is a restriction on an equation with a variable. Its left hand side and right hand side have equal values which are expressed by the sign of equivalence, that is, the equal sign. Each equation has only one solution that satisfies the equation. We have learned the equations thoroughly with examples. Now let us clear some misconceptions related to them. Misconception 1 Why is equal to sign used? To declare the result of the mathematical operation, or to indicate the relation of equivalence. From smaller classes, children normally believe that an equal to sign is always used to declare the result of a mathematical operation. Just as x plus 2 is equal to 3, tells us that the result of the addition of x and 2 is 3. The correct understanding is that the value of the addition of x and 2 written on the left hand side of the sign of equality is equal to 3. Misconception 2 What does x plus 2 and 3 represent in the equation x plus 2 is equal to 3? x plus 2 is the question and 3 is its solution. x plus 2 is the left hand side of the equation and 3 is the right-hand side of the equation. Many times, it becomes obvious that the question of mathematics is written on the left-hand side of the equal to sign and the answer on the right. Due to this misunderstanding, x plus 2 is believed to be the question and 3 is its answer, whereas the correct understanding is that x plus 2 is the left-hand side of the equation and 3 is the right-hand side. Misconception 3. On which side is an expression with variables expressed in the equation? On the left hand side, on the right hand side or either side? We are so used to expressing equations with variables on the left hand side that we find it wrong to express them on the right hand side. The correct understanding is that we can express them on either side of the equation. Let's hope that this has cleared up your misconceptions related to the concept of equations.